people. I have a Costco haul for you today. I spent way too long at Costco this morning marveling over all of their Christmas decor and I posted a shop with me yesterday. So if you want to see all the new stuff Costco has that I did not buy, go check that out. Otherwise, let's get into the food because I got a lot of it. Almost $300 worth. I feel like lately I've been good with my hauls. Like I haven't been going overboard, but this time uh, I made up for it. So let's start over here. I got a pineapple and some sweet onions. Okay, first of all, sweet onions. These are like white onions, I think. I don't know, they're kind of yellow. But they had another bag of onions that were like $3 more. I don't know, I went with those uh, because money. Strawberries, bananas, lettuce. I feel like I'm reading a book to Wentworth. Lettuce, bananas, uh, cucumbers right there. I also got some oranges. You guys know I normally buy the mandarin oranges, but I got a big one for the lunches this past week because I wanted to do something special with them, the space lunches. But before I was able to do something special with them, Eleanor ate a whole one and she said, I love these oranges. So I guess my kids love these oranges more than the mandarins, whatever. I don't care as long as they're eating something healthy. I also got a bunch of seaweed and previously I've said, oh, the seaweeds are, you know, cost so much compared to seaweed at like oriental markets and stuff. But can I explain? So it's $8 for all of these, which is a deal because when you open this thing up, it has, it's packed with seaweed. There's so much in there. So instead of my kids opening up like three packs to eat of the normal size, they open one of these and they're good. You know, so it's worth the money. So I got it this time. I also got some peppers, six peppers there. One of my favorite things to make for dinner lately has, well, favorite plus um, lazy and easy is just to cut up some peppers, cut up some onions, cut up another vegetable, maybe broccoli or Brussels sprouts. <gasps> I didn't get Brussels sprouts. Oh man, those are my fave. But it is, um, I like to cut all those things up, throw them in a pan and then put some seasoned meat on top of it and throw it in the oven for like 45 minutes. Oh my gosh. It's been delicious. It's been my favorite. I seriously did it almost every night last week. Um, except for I think one night we ate out. <laughs> uh, we also, I got some potatoes, some mini potatoes. You can throw that in the vegetable mix. Um, I got some blueberries right here. These were kind of steep. I think like six bucks, but I got a lot and I ate a bunch on the way home. I know pesticides are not good for me, but neither is malnutrition. I got some grapes. I already showed you the broccoli. Okay, this, whoo, I almost didn't get it, but I have not seen the co the chocolate covered coconut almonds. Did that make sense? You guys know what I'm talking about. They're delicious, they're amazing, but I haven't seen them at Costco. So I got these, which aren't the same thing at all, but I, I was drawn to them. Those were like 10 bucks, E. I also got some potato chips back there because Salty and crunchy things are delicious. I also got these cinnamon sticks. This is the best price I've ever seen for cinnamon sticks and you get so stinking many in here. I ha I don't know what I'm gonna do with these, but the possibilities are endless. I can craft with them. I can throw them in a pot with some apples and maybe orange peels and maybe something else. I don't, like, you know, homemade potpourri on the stovetop. You feel me? I can do everything with these and I'm excited about it. I also got some multivitamins and kid vitamins. My kids were out of vitamins and I thought, you know what? Everyone else in the house takes vitamins except for me uh, because we put ourselves last as moms and I thought, no longer. So I got some multivitamins. I don't know if I will actually take them, we'll see. I got some, I like to eat my vitamins but mm, sometimes I eat pizza instead. So. I got some of these packets. These were on sale and I have been wondering how they are. I've had this brand before. Well, I have it there for Wentworth. And I think I got the uh, green ones and then I got purple ones. They sell them at Target. It's like four packs is uh, upwards of $7. So I thought this was a good deal. There's 12 packs in here. And um, yeah, I don't know. Wentworth needs to eat too. I got some shelled pistachios. These were 13 bucks, but the ones that weren't shelled were 20 and I just wasn't about to go there. Everyone loves pistachios in my family. I also got this. This is the first time I've ever seen it. They always have the, I think it's like tortilla, chicken tortilla soup or something. My family wasn't a huge fan of that, but we do like minestrone. There's beans, there's green beans, there's pasta. I don't know what else is in there. 
Oh, an Italian medley of vegetables and seashell pasta in a savory broth. Sounds delicious, and you get a ton for as much money as you spend. I think it's worth the money. I also got some of these again. I almost didn't get them, because I got them last time. They're $12 normally, but this time they were on sale, so I said, okay, you're coming home. I think they were like $7, and um, this kind is delicious. Everyone loves it. Only half the people in my family like the yellow kind, but they still got eaten. We have none left. I got these. Next week for lunches, I'm planning something different. So uh, pizza is on the menu, so I need it. There's six of each. What? And this thing was 10 bucks. I thought, man, that's a good after school snack too. Um, I got some mini wheats. I don't know. The cereal selection just makes me upset because it's like Cheerios or like the tutti frutti marshmallow y cereal. There's like no in between, but I guess this is the in between, so I got it. I also got some chewy granola bars. My kids, you guys know, are obsessed with these. They're so good. They're mini. Well, not mini, but they're smaller than your average granola bar. Kids love, uh, whenever we have company, they eat the snozz out of those. We also got, when I say we, I mean I bought this stuff, you know what I mean? My family is going to eat this week. Uh, chicken strips, it goes along with lunch next week. Chicken strips, and plus, chicken strips. You know what I mean? I also got mashed potatoes. I've never gotten this before, but I figured, I don't know, you know, I, you know, just make it easy on myself one night. You know, give myself a little break and eat mashed potatoes. My Avelina loves mashed potatoes, but I, it's like hit or miss. If there's like a clump in one of her spoonfuls of mashed potatoes, that's it. That's the end for her. Uh, so hopefully there are no clumps in there. <laughs> there's no human error in this, right? I also got pulled pork in a can. What? Did you guys know this existed? Because I didn't. I actually, you know what? I saw it last time and I, it just wasn't in our menu last week or last time I went, I don't know, a few weeks ago. But pulled pork in a can? Unbelievable. Like how can things get any easier than this? One, two, three, four, five cans. One, two, three, four. Wow, can I count. Four cans. Uh, it's gonna be delicious. I also got Hawaiian rolls to pair with this, right? Throw in a vegetable and dinner's ready. I got some organic Greek yogurt. This is plain yogurt and I just add a little bit of agave to it to sweeten it up and Wentworth loves that. The, I think these were on sale for seven something. Look at, holy snaws, look at all of that kielbasa. I don't know what I'm gonna make with it, but I'm sure it's gonna be delicious. Feta cheese crumbles, I love this. It's my daily salad, feta cheese, cucumber, romaine lettuce, red onion, man, I forgot to buy red onion, but you know what, Alex, like I told you guys, we had pizza the other day, and we got some red onion on the side, <laughs> so I'll use that in my salad until I go to the store and buy red onions. All right, I also got these crepes. I almost didn't, but my kids love them so much, and it is such an easy breakfast, like, oh, just grab a crepe, you know, and they'll eat it real quick. I got some tortillas, and if you saw my shop with me, you saw that the normal tortillas are twice as much as, oh no, no, cheaper. They're $4 for twice as many, but the whole wheat tortillas are like more expensive. I think these were five or $6 for just 20, but you know what? If you're wondering which one I went with, nutrition won, okay? Health won this time. Uh, next time it might not. This, chicken. I haven't gotten a chicken from Costco in a long time, and you guys, the, ugh, they have to, I don't know what they do to their chickens, inject them with deliciousness, but it's really good. Got these Hawaiian rolls, got some butter because uh, baking season is upon us. I also got, last two things, I got some, ugh, sorry, my throat is so scratchy, I feel like I'm getting sick, but I'm not going to acknowledge it because it's not gonna happen. Um, I got six rolls of tape. This was on sale this week for $6 and I couldn't pass it up. It's like the good quality tape, you know? Like, I, of course I could go to the Dollar Tree and get two rolls of tape for the same price, but the quality is what I'm looking for here, okay? And then I got some heavy duty Reynolds wrap. What is this, tin foil? Yes. I don't know if this is gonna fit in the drawer, actually, <laughs> the drawer that I normally store it in. This is crazy. I needed tin foil, so I went in the aisle at Costco and they had like the biggest roll of tin foil I've ever seen. I was like, good Lord, I don't need that much, but even this is pushing it. Woo, I really hope I'm not getting sick. I say that because Wentworth is a little under the weather. Oh my gosh, now that I say that, I'm like feeling it everywhere. My throat, my eyes, my nose. 
Oh, Lord, help me. Okay, that is everything I got from Costco. And now I'm excited. No, it's not everything I got because I also got five hot dogs on the way out the door and everyone's outside eating them right now. They were in the pool because, yes, it's the middle of October. Well, is it the middle of October? Anyway, it's October and they are swimming because that's how hot it is still in Florida. Where is the cold front? Where are you? You're more than welcome here. Come on, bring it on. We're waiting for you. Uh, so what am I going to eat first is the question. Probably leftovers, to be honest. Okay, I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Bye.